back. I am super excited because I got in the mail a couple of days ago my Too Faced Rock and Roll palette and my Too Faced Country palette. So today I'm wearing the Rock and Roll palette and that's what I'm going to um, swatch for you and tell you about today and then I will do the country palette next week. Um, if you want to see a tutorial for this look then just leave me a comment below and I will be happy to do that. So the first thing that's really different with the new Too Faced palettes is it's this metal tin now which I really like. I like it a lot better than the cardboard um, cases that they had before where you had to flip up um, and open it up. I like this a lot better and this is what it looks like inside and of course it comes with the little um, guide that gives you some looks and then there's a mirror on the other side of that. Um, it comes with nine eyeshadow colors and there they are and they all have these really cute rock and roll names. Um, the first, the top set is kind of more of like an everyday and there's rockabilly which is um, a matte um, just taupe and then there is wrap which is the shimmery gold and ska which is a shimmery brown um, kind of a goldish brown um, I have a uh, wrap and ska both on right now. And then in this next row here, you have New Wave, which is a glittery pink pop, which is a really shimmery purple, and Heavy Metal, which is this beautiful shimmery navy. Um, and then on this last row, which is what they're calling the fashion row, you have New Romantic, which is kind of a, a satin taupe, glam rock, which is kind of a um, shimmery, like brownish gray, and then punk, which is this beautiful uh, glittery emerald. So really all of the colors in here are, um, have some glitter or shimmer to them except for rockabilly. So that is the only matte shade in the entire palette. Um, New Romantic um, is a satin finish. It doesn't really have like glitter in it, but it does have some shimmer to it. And then um, most of the um, colors over here do have some level of glitter with wrap, of course, being uh, the most glittery because it's gold. Um, really, you can tell after I have swatched this, there really isn't any fallout, which is great. That's one of the complaints that I have sometimes about um, Too Faced colors that, is that there is a lot of fallout, especially to the ones that are really pigmented. Overall, I love this palette. I think that it's got um, enough that you can do something like what I've done here, which is a little bit more of an everyday look. I am getting ready to go to work, so I did kind of tone it down just a little bit. But you also have a lot of colors that you can just play and have fun with. So this is a really great palette. If you are looking for something that's just fun to add to your collection, I highly recommend it. And if you are um, new to finding eye makeup and you're looking for um, something that you can play around with and have fun with, you already have picked up a neutral palette, or maybe you're just not a neutral person like me. I don't really go for neutrals um, all that much except for sort of in my base colors. This is a really great palette to pick up. The packaging is just adorable. I, I absolutely love it and of course anything rock and roll is super close to my heart because I am a total rock and roll girl. So I really love this palette. Um, it was um, $36 I believe um, and I ordered it from Ulta. You can also order it from Too Faced.com and Sephora. Um, I will leave a link below to um, blog post as soon as I get it up with close-ups of swatches and things like that. So keep an eye out for those. And thanks for watching so much today. Again, if you would like to see a tutorial for this look or any looks from this palette, then just leave me a comment below and I'll post some of those later. Thanks for watching today. Bye!